We're looking for um, the perfect chicken wing. Can you guys help us? I was like, My mom making those chicken wings. <laughs> In the dark, no, any chicken wings? I don't know where they make good chicken wings. Chicken, chicken wings. Oh, chicken wings. Oh, chicken wings. Yeah. You can try. Oh, Fort Byron. Fort Byron? He knows it's Fort Byron. Part of the movie is that we're on a search for the perfect wing. We're traveling across New York State. That's tough to do. It's going to be tough to make that call. My best wing and your best wing may not be what his best wing is. You know, it's like searching for the perfect wave. I mean, it only exists. I mean, for that for that brief moment. I really do want to find the perfect one. I mean, I, I am I am serious about it. So I sent him a description of why the wings were so good, and Matt got back to me and said, "You got to join us." Ben Beavers, A.K.A. the Mighty Thor, semi-professional eater. I'm going to challenge any ordinary person to see who can eat more wings. Al Caster, I play a guitar. We do the funky chicken. You will never know what you might. It's uh, not the best time for us. No, I mean, our son will only be a couple of months old. I grew up here in Lyons, New York. This town has a population of about 5,000. When I was really young, there were no chicken wings. And then there was like this explosion. And all of a sudden, there were chicken wings everywhere. And I was eating them about three or four times a week. I met two Slovak girls, and they said, you should go to Slovakia. And I said, where the hell is Slovakia? I probably work for every half-assed publication in Central Europe. Uh, and there are a lot of half-assed publications <laughs> in Central Europe. Moved my way up the food chain until finally I got a job at Reuters News Agency. Reading Reuters to do chicken wing documentaries is absurd. If you say that you want to eat, then... Then I wanted to know that I was a bad guy. At this bar right here in 1964, she woke up like a miracle. So she took those wings and she cut them in half and she came up with this red hot sauce. If they weren't from Sicily, you know, we'd be eating wings with like marinara sauce. A little bit of wine and a little bit of spicy. I believe that heaven had something to do with it. And so they started eating these wings and they went crazy. He says, would you believe we got the chicken wings on the menu? I said, are you shitting me? And pretty soon, you couldn't go anywhere that uh, didn't have wings. Stop and think how many chickens they have to kill to get the wings. We're big son of a bitches, baby. <laughs> Whether the perfect wing exists or not, I think, um, it's one of those questions for the ages. Ha, 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 ha.